beaten to death. The last thing Abdul Rasul said to his family was that he was going to the shops. He headed towards his checkpoint, manned by police and militia, and never came back. He is never involved in any politics. I don't know why he, they are targeting, shoot him, or do this thing to him. He is never any do any politics. He is a faithful guy, peaceful guy. He was one of this country, part of this country. Many here say this new level of violence is being organized and coordinated by a foreign power. Now, Saudi army coming here, they are, it must be Shia to count. This is the thing which is happening in our country. Like this, we are thinking now, the government, not Al Khalifa now. No, government is Al Saud. Fear in this community is growing. We are in a chaos. We can't document even the exact number of detainees. A lot of uh, lost people has been reported. Now it is around uh, 60s and the number is increasing. Uh, but one, do one day after another, we are finding out that some of these lost people are not detainees. They are killed people. <laughs> For the first time, family members see the body. They shout the country's ruler will never win. Hands raised in the sign of victory, a shattered community vowing defiance.